Brains versus brawn. It's an age-old question that some researchers claim to have answered a few years ago, and of course they claim brains won. So a bunch of smart people said that being smart is better than being strong. Got it. Anyway, when it comes to motor control, it doesn't matter. Since his last appearance on Tech Chats, Mike Williams has been working out hard and studying even harder, so he can tell us all about Infineon's iMotion Smart IPM solutions for motor control, which are the brainiest and the brawniest ICs for connected motor control applications. Welcome back to Tech Chats, Mike. Thanks, Chris. Appreciate that. Now, the context for this discussion on motor control is really connected appliances. So what's driving that market? Well, the appliance market has really been evolving over the past decade or so, and this is primarily driven by inverterization and the introduction of smart appliances. And the consumer now has a choice in selecting their next ENERGY STAR rated appliance. Inverterization has become a competitive differentiator. As many people understand the energy savings associated with variable speed motor control or the ECM motors that they're getting inside their system and the lower overall energy costs of operating the appliance. Finian is really leading the industry in connected motor control solutions by bringing together the power se- semiconductor solutions from Infineon and the connectivity and HMI or human interface solutions uh, from our recent acquisition of Cypress Semiconductor. Today, I'd like to talk about the solutions within Infineon's industrial power control division, which enables manufacturers to reduce system costs through in-house inverterization and tools Infineon has available. So three major trends are really driving the evolution of connected appliances, which in turn is driving semiconductor content. Energy efficiency, which is being increased by new standards and government regulations. For example, fur regulations went into effect in the summer of 2019. And that said, every furnace now has to have an ECM motor integrated into the system. Also inverterization, which introduces variable speed motor control and the utilization of permanent magnets or BLDC motors allows for significantly improved efficiency of the motor. And this really comes down to a shift from the PSC or permanent split capacitor motor to an ECM motor, where you're going from around 60% efficiency to greater than 80% efficiency. And the smart home. So no longer do we actually have to turn on our light switches. We can ask Alexa to do that now. So thanks to wireless connectivity solutions, you know, you really have a lot of new capabilities in the smart home arena that didn't exist in the past. Here you can see Infineon's products support all the core functionalities of connected appliances. System control and connectivity with the PSOC 6, motor control with the iMotion, and the industry's broadest portfolio of powered semiconductors for the inverter. With the introduction of high efficiency HVAC systems, you're really starting to see the introduction of connected motor control applications within the HVAC unit. So here you have three motor drives, the largest being the compressor drive, which is in the range of two kilowatts to seven kilowatts, the main blower motor for circulating the air, uh, that's in the range of 300 watts to 750 watts, and the condenser fan, typically around 300 watts. You have a variety of sensors available for the system monitoring. You have temperature sensors, pressure sensors, uh, a CO2 sensor, a coolant sensor, which could be used for the next regulations when they're transitioning to mildly flammable coolant materials and a radar sensor for occupancy sensing at a thermostat. All of these are reporting back to a system controller, which makes the decisions on how to regulate the system. The introduction of connectivity by Bluetooth or Wi-Fi module opens up smart home functionality, but also predictive maintenance, condition monitoring, and remote diagnostics with cloud integrations. Infineon can help you with all these solutions, but today we'll focus on connected motor drive solutions. So for connected motors, where does Infineon fit in? Infineon can help with basically all aspects of an ECM motor drive. So we have the Cypos IPM product family. These are intelligent power modules. For an HVAC system, they typically range in the power of 20 watts all the way up to about one and a half horsepower for the main blower motor. They have integrated gate drivers, and this is really providing you the performance in a compact, cost-effective package. It's fully integrated, over-molded, and uh, isolated. So all of your core components uh, for the inverter assembly are located in this package. We also have the iMotion controller, which is an FOC motor controller. This is a single controller basically for all HVAC requirements. You can use it to control the compressor, the condenser fan, the blower motor. The big advantage here is that this has full UART capability. So you can have bi-directional communication from iMotion back to the main system controller, which will allow you to pull information from your load iMotion also has capabilities for doing PFC control, both totem pole and 
standard boost topologies. You can do scripting functions, which will allow you to do auxiliary functionality. It also has the possibility of having dual core, so one blank core to do um, system control and one other core to do motor control functionality. We also have different hardware integration solutions with the smart driver and smart IPM. Looking at the rest of the architecture associated with the motor control, we have the cool set power supply devices for your flyback power supply. This is providing you the logic level control voltages for your motor controller. And then also other motor control solutions from our Cypress integration, like the PSOC 6 for HMI control, as well as uh, integration for connectivity like Bluetooth and Wi-Fi. And then we have Optiga embedded security solutions, which is the hardware-based security solution. All right, and you mentioned addressing applications from 20 watts to one and a half horsepower with your Cypos IPMs. Can you tell me a bit more about those? Yeah, so here you see an overview of the portfolio that we have within the Cypos IPM family. And in fact, Chris, the power ranges actually go up above that. But in terms of the HVAC system, typically you're seeing IPM applications tapping out around one and a half horsepower. But outside of that, we can support applications up to four kilowatts and even higher power uh, with higher voltage solutions like the Cypos Maxi. So as you're looking at the solutions along the bottom from left to right, you're transitioning from low power applications in the 20 watt range all the way to high power solutions in the four kilowatt or plus um, power rating. And these are, are over-molded packages uh, with, for a three-phase inverter with six IGBTs inside or MOSFETs, as well as the gate drivers integrated. So it's your full inverter topology inside of a single solution. Okay, so we promised people brains and brawn. I think that covers the brawn. Let's talk about the brains now. So iMotion is really the brains of the motor control solution. iMotion integrates hardware and software by bringing together a fully qualified motor control software with three core hardware configurations, the smart IPM, the smart driver, and the iMotion controller, all in a single solution. iMotion is Infineon's dedicated motor control iMotion features a professional motor control engine with UL Class B qualified FOC motor control software, supporting reduced time to market for manufacturers, and iMotion hardware, which enables manufacturers to lower system costs through integration in solutions like the Smart Driver and Smart IPM. And what do developers or designers get from the motor control engine? Well, the iMotion software powered by the MCE 2.0 software system is really providing you the flexibility to control basically any type of motor load in the application. So iMotion has the capability of having up to 15 parameter sets loaded into it for different motor configurations. It's a full FOC uh, motor controller, but it also has the capability of using hall-based sensor operation. It has bi-directional communication built in for UART control. There's a scripting engine inside of the device, which allows you to write up to 1,500 lines of code uh, to do special functionality or integrate uh, motor control algorithms, for instance, in an HVAC application, uh, constant airflow algorithms. It also has the full programmability for uh, PFC in both boost and totem pole configurations. And then iMotion also provides the protection for your motor. So this is a UL Class B qualified software. So all the core protections are already approved with the agencies and allows you to do you know, full overcurrent, under voltage lockout, rotor lock, gate kill, you know, all the standard protections that are common in motor control applications. What about the hardware side of the iMotion platform? Yeah, iMotion hardware really exists in three different configurations. The iMotion controller, which is just a core controller that integrates either with a gate driver and MOSFETs or IGBTs in a discrete solution and or an IPM for a fully integrated solution. You also have the smart driver. This incorporates the controller plus gate drivers into a single package and then integrates with discrete based switch components, either MOSFETs or IGBTs, typically targeting the 300 watts and below application space. And then you have the smart IPM and that brings the next level of integration by combining the controller, the gate drivers and the switches into a single package, a really compact PQFM package, which is targeting applications roughly 100 watts and below. Here you see an overview of the iMotion controller, and the iMotion controller is really the brains of the motor control solution. And we actually have two different core configurations of the iMotion controller itself. A single core solution, uh, which just has the MCE software, the motor control software, and then a dual core solution, which has a blank core uh, for system functionality and a standard core for iMotion control uh, with the iMotion engine integrated. 
Uh, the big advantage here is that you can integrate it with either discrete base solutions and or IPM. So there's really no limitation in the power switching devices that you can use with the device. So it provides you a lot of flexibility. And you have the capability of doing UART control and UART control really provides um, the information stream, which is imperative uh, for connectivity functionality and eventual integration into the cloud. We talked earlier about connected HVAC systems and the introduction of predictive maintenance and condition monitoring. So what is the real advantage of predictive or proactive maintenance? This really comes down to the ability to detect defects in an early stage and have advanced analytics to predict machine failures before they happen. So what does a system require in order to implement predictive or proactive maintenance? The answer is information. The advantage of iMotion is that it offers a connected motor control solution for predictive maintenance by enabling the UART control to transmit information about your load. So for example, a listing of the sampling parameters available with an iMotion, you can understand your output phase currents, your DC bus voltage, the temperature of the NTC thermistor, uh, motor control angle, speed, back EMF, all of the core parameters associated with the motor can be pulled out of the iMotion device through the UART control back to your main system controller, and then through some type of connectivity functionality uploaded to the cloud, which enables you to do predictive maintenance functionalities. Now, if we go up to that next level of integration, what do we get with the iMotion smart driver devices? So the iMotion smart driver is really another level of integration. It combines the iMotion controller and the gate drivers, uh, specifically targeting discrete solutions for small motor drive applications. An example would be a compressor drive in a refrigerator or a drain pump uh, for a dishwasher or washing machine. These applications are typically in the range of, you know, 20 watts all the way up to around 300 watts. And you're really looking for a nice, small, compact solution in a tight package. Uh, the iMotion Smart Driver is available in both a PFC and non-PFC version, as well as a version with a blank core, which does not include the iMotion software if you decide you want to program the device yourself. And then what about that last integration step with the smart IPMs? So the iMotion smart IPM really brings the next level of integration. It combines the iMotion controller, the gate driver, and the switches into a single solution. In this particular case, the iMotion smart IPM integrates MOSFETs in three different RDS on specifications, 6 ohms, 1.4 ohms, and 0.95 ohms. And this really gives you a capability of having a power range in the sub 30 watt range all the way up to around 100 watts. The big advantage here is that it's targeting applications that are um, compact and need you know, high levels of integration to meet the packaging requirements of the solution and application. So here you see the integration of a customer's condenser fan. Uh, the initial solution utilized uh, a Cypos Mini IPM combined with an iMotion controller. That's the top image that you see here. The next level of integration basically went from a Cypos IPM Mini into a Nano IPM with the iMotion controller. You see here in the middle, much smaller solution. And then the final level of integration is really bringing together the smart IPM solution where you have all of the devices for both power and control integrated into a single package solution. So really reducing the overall footprint of the customer's board and the overall cost associated with the board by making it smaller. So if someone sees this and decides, hey, this is a good fit for my next design, what's the best way for them to get started? So we have the iMotion Evaluation Board in three different configurations. Uh, and this provides you a complete motor control solution that allows you to test uh, your actual load um, utilizing your PC. So the PC plugs in through the USB cable into the board, and then you can program in the core parameters of your motor and then spin your motor. We generally like to say we can spin your motor in less than an hour with iMotion. That's great. So now we've talked about the brains, we've talked about the brawn, but at the end of the day, what do designers really need to know about iMotion? Well, there's a couple of system advantages for iMotion. It really comes down to the fact that you have a full FOC motor control software integrated into the device, and this significantly reduces your time to market. It also provides you the benefits of integration of PFC control, plus the performance of iMotion software is really good for low acoustic noise and improved DMI. 
You also have a system cost reduction associated with the different levels of hardware integration with the iMotion devices, for instance, smart driver, smart IPM, and then the flexibility to pretty much work with any type of motor. Because you're programming in the core parameter sets that define what your motor is, iMotion really works with any motor in any application. So it's a solution that provides you flexibility and significantly reduced time to market to bring the customer solution to market much quicker. All right. And there's one thing that you've mentioned that we haven't talked about, and that's the MADK evaluation platform. What's that? Yeah, the MADK evaluation platform is really your hardware, your software solution for motor drives. It provides you an 80% completed motor drive solution by combining together the control boards that you see on the left and the power boards that you see on the right. And these power boards have either discrete based components and or uh, IPM solutions and cover an application range all the way up to 11 kilowatts uh, with our Cyplus Maxi product. So it really is a solution that allows you to significantly reduce your time to market. The Infineon Mad K platform really provides the customer the complete solution for in-house motor drive development. Along with the MADK board, we're also providing you the complete reference design schematics for the solution. So this is your layout file, as well as the schematic file. Combining the MADK platform solution with the fact that iMotion is a UL Class B qualified software, you have all the protection functions integrated into the solution from the beginning. And then we provide you excellent support through our experienced FAE and application support team. And we can do schematics reviews and layout reviews and also help support motor tuning and scripting functionality. So at Infineon, we're focused on connected motor control solutions. By combining the iMotion controller, the brains, and power components like the Cypos IPM, the brawn, we bring together a completed connected motor control solution for customers. Thanks, Mike. Once again, that's Mike Williams from Infineon Technologies. If you'd like to learn more about Infineon's iMotion Smart IPM Connected Motor Control Solutions, click the links in the description or visit mauser.com. And be sure to check back soon for the next episode of Tech Chats. Thank you.